Kunatori 6, Kunatori 6 Hauji, also known as HTV-6, is the sixth flight of the H-2 transfer vehicle, an unmanned cargo spacecraft launched to resupply the International Space Station. It was launched at 13 hours 26 minutes and 47 seconds Coordinated Universal Time on 9 December 2016 aboard HIIB launch vehicle from Tanegashima Space Center. <laughs> Spacecraft Major changes from previous Kunatori include built-in payloads to demonstrate new technologies, SFINKS and KITE, described below Reduction of primary batteries to six from previous seven Reduction of solar cell panels to 48 from previous 49 Emission of some of navigation, position lights which were Earth-side when approaching to ISS. Strengthened EP exposed pallet maximum payload to 1.9 T from previous 1.6 T to carry Li-ion batteries, SFINKS solar cell film array sheet for next generation on Kunatori 6 will test thin film solar cells in space. Topic: Kunatori Integrated Tether Experiment. Kite Kunatori Integrated Tether Experiment was an experimental electrodynamic tether (EDT). The tether was equipped with a 20 kg end mass and would have been 700 meters long when deployed. A maximum current of 10 mA was planned to run through the tether. Kunotri's ISS rendezvous sensor would have been utilized to measure how the end mass moves during the test. The EDT experiment was scheduled following Kunotori 6's departure from the ISS, with a planned duration of one week. After the experiment, the tether would have been separated before the spacecraft proceeds with the de orbit maneuvers. The main objective of this experiment were the orbital demonstration of both extending an uncoated bare tether, and driving electric currents through the EDT. These two technologies will contribute to gaining capabilities to remove space debris. Cargo <coughs> 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 Kunatori 6 carries about 5.9 t of cargo including the support structure weight consisting of 3.9 t in PLC pressurized logistics carrier and 1.9 t in ULC unpressurized logistics carrier cargo in the pressurized compartment includes 30 bags filled with potable water 600 liters food crew commodities CDRA bed carbon Dioxide Removal Assembly, TPF, Two-Phase Flow Experiment Unit, PSTEPC Position-Sensitive Tissue Equivalent Proportional Chamber Radiation Measurement Instrument, EXAM Exposed Experiment Handrail Attachment Mechanism, HDTVEF2 High Def and 4K Camera, New JSSOD GEM Small Satellite Orbital Deployer, and CubeSats Alba VLOX3 Tupod which comprises two tubesats Tancredo 1 and OSNSAT, EG, ITF2, Stars C, Freedom, WASEDASAT3. Cargo by Nanorax includes TECHEDSAT5, Cuberider, RTC MIS, NREPP7 German Marks, 4 Lima 2. Additionally, the Blue Spheres satellite of the MIT Space Systems Laboratory is being returned to the ISS for continued autonomous systems research. Cargo in the unpressurized compartment consists of six lithium ion batteries and their associated adapter plates to replace existing nickel hydrogen batteries of the ISS. 
Since each of the new Li-ion battery has a capability equivalent to two of the current Ni-H batteries, the six new batteries will replace 12 old batteries, out of the 48 existing batteries of the ISS. On departure from the ISS, Kunatori 6 will carry nine out of the 12 replaced old batteries which will be disposed by destructive re-entry into Earth's atmosphere. The three remaining old batteries will stay on the ISS. Topic: Operation. Topic: Launch. On 26 July 2016, the launch was scheduled for 30 September 2016, but on 10 August 2016, postponement was announced due to the leak from piping. The HIIB launch vehicle carrying Kunatori 6 lifted off at 13 hours 26 minutes and 47 seconds Coordinated Universal Time on 9 December 2016. 15 minutes 11 seconds later, Kunatori 6 was released into initial 200 km × 300 km orbit. SFINKS experiment payload began the data collection at 14:16, 9 December 2016, but it stopped unexpectedly after 509 seconds. After a series of orbital maneuvers, Kunatori 6 arrived to the proximity of ISS and captured by SSRMS at 10:39, 10:37 according to NASA, the 13th of December 2016. Kunatori was bolted to the CBM common berthing mechanism of the Harmony Nadir port by 13:48 coordinated universal time. Topic: <laughs> Operation while berthed to ISS. Berthing operation completed at 18:24, the 13th of December 2016 UTC, and the hatch opened at 19:44 Coordinated Universal Time. Since 7:44, the 14th of December, exposed pallet (EP) was extracted from unpressurized logistics carrier (ULC) of Kunatori by SSRMS and transferred to payload and Oru accommodation (POA). After a combination of two extravehicular activities and robotic operations, the lithium-ion battery units and adapter plates were installed. The exposed pallet carrying old nickel-hydrogen battery units was returned to Kunatori 6's unpressurized logistics carrier on 23 January 2017. Topic: Departure from the ISS and re-entry to the Earth atmosphere. SSRMS grappled and detached Kunatori 6 from the CBM of Harmony Nadir port at 10:59, the 27th of January 2017, and Kunatori 6 was released at 15:45, the 27th of January 2017, following the undocking after moving to a safe distance from ISS. The Kunatori 6 was to demonstrate the Kunatori Integrated Tether Experiment kite", using electrodynamic tether to demonstrate space debris removal technology. This experiment was planned for seven days before re-entry to the Earth's atmosphere. On January 31, media reported some problems in extending the tether, bringing to doubt the experiment's success. A series of deorbit maneuvers were performed at 8:42, 10:12, and 14:42 of the 5th of February 2017 UTC. Kunatori 6 re-entered to Earth atmosphere over Southern Pacific Ocean around 1506, 5 February 2017 UTC